to the wonderful world of electronics and YouTube. Today we have a most interesting little circuit for you. As you can see, it's a little more complicated than the ones we've had in the last couple of weeks. Here we have a microphone and this feeds into an amplifier stage and then to a bistable flip-flop which is able to store an on or off condition. And then the signal passes through to this transistor here that amplifies it and feeds the coil of this relay. So the purpose of this little circuit is to receive a sharp pulse, say from a hand clap on the microphone, and when that happens, it will cause the circuit element to trip and the relay to close. Another clap will turn the relay off. So you get it, clap on, the light comes on or relay comes on, clap, the light goes off or the relay goes off. We don't have it hooked to a light at the moment, but we're interested to prove that the relay closes and opens. Once the relay closes and opens, the rest is a done deal. So we turn it on here now, and it comes up in the on condition. Okay, so we do a sharp clap, and as you can see, the contact is open. So the light would be off at this point in time. Okay, now we've connected the bulb. As you can see, the power, the mains power is coming down here and it's going through the relay that we just saw in the last uh, few seconds. And we have here a capacitor, which purpose is to prevent a spark, which would shorten the life of the contacts and possibly cause them to stick. And then the electricity comes right down and flows into our standard domestic light bulb, the sort you might have in your garage. Okay, now observe, the light comes on, the light goes off, and I don't even have to clap so hard. A slightly shorter clap, a slightly shorter clap. Notice the noise is less, oops, that's not. There you go, there you go. So thank you for joining us on YouTube, and we'll see you soon again.